This is FYI on your TV, brought to you by Hometown News. I'm Kathy Botham. I've got Erin Potvan back with me. You're with Alzheimer's Society, Lanark Leeds, Grenville. Welcome back. Thanks for having me. You've been here almost on a monthly basis. You've got so much going on <laughs> at that, uh, our local Alzheimer's Society, too. Yes. So yes. let's talk about the last time you were here, you were talking about the IG uh, Wealth Management Walk for Alzheimer's. How did it yes, go? Yes, very, very good. Um, our goal was 20,000, and we hit it. So yay Excellent. for that. Excellent, yes. Um, we're actually closer to 21,000 now, which is um, really great. So yeah, we're super grateful for our community for coming together and helping us reach our goal and we couldn't really do it without them. So, And this is an annual event as well for yes. you and sort of coming out of the pandemic, you were able to get together. Yes, and it was a really good turnout. Um, I want to say we had over 40 people there, which is um, probably the biggest walk we've ever had in the history of our walks. So yeah, it was all around great day. We had beautiful weather. Um, Lower Reach Park was a great spot for us. The loop was perfect. And yeah, no complaints. All right. Now, yeah. so what's the summer look like for our Alzheimer's Society? So um, we have a golf tournament coming up. Mm -hmm. So on July 15th at Timber One Golf Course, um, we have a golf tournament coming up, the Bob and Isabel Golf for Alzheimer's. It's uh, $125 a person, so $500 for a foursome. Um, for people that are used to it in the past, it's pretty much um, the exact same as past years. Uh, shotguns start at 11. Registration will start around 10. And uh, yeah, we're hoping for really good weather for that too. And that includes a meal too. Yes, yes, Absolutely. meal. Um, we're gonna have raffle prizes, we're gonna have entry prizes, um, best women's team, best men's team prizes, um, and a silent auction. Excellent, yeah. and this is an annual event. It's been going on for a few yes, years. Yes, it's going on for quite a few years, yes. Okay. You still yes. have some room for registration? Yes, we do. So we're hoping to get around uh, 36 teams. Right now I'd say we have around 20. Um, so yeah, we're really trying to push it out there uh, to let people know that we're doing it again this year and get some more people signed up for it. How do people register? So you can contact me, you can send me an email at epotvin at alzllg.ca or you can just give us a call at 1-866-576-8556 and just say you want to register for golf and uh, they'll be able to forward you on to to me. All right. Now, yeah. in terms of our Alzheimer's Society here in, in Lanark, uh, Leeds and Grenville too, yeah. summer's coming up, but you don't mm -hmm. slow down. We still no. need uh, support. We still need yeah. volunteers. Yes, and typically, um, some, some, sometimes summers do slow down a little bit, um, but this year we got um, a grant funding for Minds in Motion, so we're going to do more programs with that throughout the summer, which is really exciting. Um, so yeah, yeah, busy, busy. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Can yeah. you talk a little bit about some of the programs that we do here? Yeah, for sure. So for example, our Minds in Motion, um, it's once a week, and Right now we're doing it in Brockville on Thursdays, but that's um, ending shortly, and then we're gonna start it in Smith Falls and then Perth, which is great to bring it back uh, to Lanark, and it's music therapy, um, and there's also, you know, like an athletic kind of um, aerobics kind of going on in it too, um, and it's for the caregiver and for the uh, client, so it's kind of good to get out with um, your loved one or your friend and uh, support them with the program that will help them, you know, in the long run. And uh, yeah, so we're super great to get the funding for that too. Uh, to do some more programs. Awesome, awesome. Yeah. And, and what I do know about our Alzheimer's Society too, mm -hmm. it's not just supporting the person with Alzheimer's, it's supporting the family and yes. the friends around too. Exactly, so we do support groups as well. Um, so there's specific support groups, so if you have a loved one in long-term care, um, there's support groups for that. Um, if your loved one is a, is a parent, there's a support group for that. Um, and then you can make connections with people that are, um, you know, similar situation and uh, it's really good to, to talk about what's going on and, and know that you're not alone. Um, going through it, yeah. Right, and yeah. I, I, Robin Hall's been here a few times, quite yes. a few times, yes. <laughs> and she talks about a, a training that uh, local businesses and, and agencies yeah. have taken, in, you know, in, in case you come across somebody who may have Alzheimer's, and it's just yeah. a little bit of training and a little bit of caring techniques. Exactly, and it's called uh, Dementia Friendly Communities, and Robin's great. We also have Sean McFadden in Brockville, if um, anybody's yes. interested in Brockville to do it. And uh, yeah, it's just training all your staff on what to do um, in certain situations and just let people with dementia in the community know that if they come to your business, it is a safe place and that, you know, judgment-free zone, I guess you could say. Absolutely. Because um, you never know what's going to happen. Absolutely. Yeah. And maybe who to contact. Exactly. Uh, if yeah. you find somebody who's in a little bit of duress. Yes. Uh, you've got a big catchment area, though, too. We say Lanark yes. leads to Grenville. It is huge. You it is huge. Brockville yeah, we're, we're, we're all over the know, Yeah. <laughs> So what is your catchment yeah. area? So um, we do Brockville, Perth, Carlton Place, Smith Falls, Almont, wow. and I want to say right now that that's it. I don't think I missed any. That's huge. Um, yeah. That's huge. <laughs> yeah. I know. You need to almost write it down some days to, to remember what it is. But yeah, and we're still trying to hope to expand a little bit into the smaller communities 
um, still within Lanark Leeds Grenville, but yeah, for now those are our main main spots. And, and I mean, the Alzheimer's Society needs our, our help, and mm -hmm. it, what's really cool about you, you coming here, you, you, you have great events. You've got a cool. golf tournament, you can support our Alzheimer's Society. You yes. had a walk, you can supp or support exactly. our, our Alzheimer's Society. Yeah. Fun ways to support such an important yes. cause in our community. Yeah, yeah, right. yeah. I'm super excited. Um, I think the golf tournament's going to be a huge hit. Uh, we got a lot of silent auction items coming in. Um, WestJet kindly gave us, you know, a voucher for uh, two for flight, which is pretty cool. Wow. Um, so that'll be there. We got Wonderland tickets for day passes. Um, we have local businesses giving us, you know, baskets with their items in it. So yeah, I think it's going to be a really good day. It's going to be huge. Yeah. It's going to be huge. How do people register yeah. once again for our golf tournament? So you can send me an email mm -hmm. at epotvin at alzllg.ca or you can just give us a call at 1-866-576-8556. Perfect. Perfect. Well, thank okay. you once again for coming here. Thanks for uh, having We're going to be taking a little bit of a summer break yeah. here in FYI, but I'm sure in September you're going to have something. Uh, yep. We have your tournament in September, so oh, um, it's going to be out in right. Lanark too. So yeah, I'm sure you'll see me again. Excellent. We'll book you in for <laughs> sure. Good. We'll book you in. Erin Podvent, our, our uh, fund development and communication coordinator for our Alzheimer's Society, Lanark, Leeds, and Grenville. Huge area. Yeah. we got to get out and support them. Exactly. Thanks, Thanks Kathy. Thanks for joining us. <laughs>